The death of the King of Pop, Michael Jackson, on June 25, 2009, sent shockwaves around the world, leaving fans mourning the loss of an iconic figure in the music industry. However, in the years following his passing, controversy and speculation surrounding the circumstances of his death have persisted, with recent allegations suggesting foul play involving his family. Michael Jackson's untimely demise at the age of 50 was initially attributed to a propofol and benzodiazepine intoxication, with his personal physician, Dr. Conrad Murray, ultimately convicted of involuntary manslaughter for administering the fatal dose of the powerful anesthetic. While Murray served time in prison for his role in Jackson's death, questions regarding the events leading up to that tragic day have continued to linger. In a shocking turn of events, recent reports have surfaced alleging that Michael Jackson himself believed his family members were conspiring against him, ultimately leading to his demise. These claims stem from a purported handwritten note found in Jackson's possession, in which he accused his family members of plotting to kill him for his estate. The contents of the alleged note, which have yet to be independently verified, suggest that Jackson harbored deep-seated mistrust and paranoia towards his relatives, particularly in relation to his vast estate and financial assets. According to the note, Jackson believed that certain family members were motivated by greed and sought to manipulate and control him for their own financial gain. The emergence of these allegations has reignited long-standing tensions within the Jackson family and raised questions about the dynamics at play behind the scenes. While some have dismissed the claims as baseless conspiracy theories, others argue that Jackson's troubled relationship with his family, compounded by the pressures of fame and fortune, may have contributed to his psychological distress in the years leading up to his death. Moreover, the timing of these revelations coincides with ongoing legal battles over Jackson's estate, which remains one of the most valuable and contested in the entertainment industry. With billions of dollars at stake, the prospect of foul play and manipulation adds another layer of complexity to an already convoluted situation. Despite the sensational nature of these allegations, it is essential to approach them with caution and skepticism, given the lack of concrete evidence corroborating Jackson's purported claims. Nevertheless, the mere suggestion that the King of Pop may have felt threatened by those closest to him sheds new light on the complexities of his personal and professional life. As the investigation into Michael Jackson's death and the subsequent fallout continues to unfold, one thing remains clear— the legacy of the King of Pop endures, transcending the controversies and conflicts that have surrounded his life and death. While the truth may never be fully known, the music and memories he left behind continue to resonate with fans worldwide, ensuring that his influence will endure for generations to come. Asterisk Michael Jackson's son and mother may have stood united over legal affairs involving the late King of Pop's estate, but no more. In December, Catherine filed motions asking that the estate pay for the legal bills she incurred in making her objections, including the ongoing appeal. Earlier this month, Branca and McLean voiced strong opposition to Catherine's request to pay for what they called her failed objection and meritless appeal, Billboard noted. In Blanket's eyes, his grandmother's appeal isn't a solid win and not worth the estate footing the legal bill to pursue. Court documents note Blanket's reasoning, adding comments he made about the appeal not truly benefiting the beneficiaries of the trust to continue the fight. As an heir to the estate, Blanket has a personal and financial interest in the situation. Catherine may want the estate to step in with paying legal fees, but Blanket isn't yielding. As a result, he is asking the court to use its best judgment to grant Catherine reasonable attorney's fees incurred from the pre-appeal battle. Despite not siding with Catherine in appealing the case, Blank does agree that the Jackson matriarch is entitled to available funds prior to the appeal at least to a certain extent. News of the legal drama surrounding the Jackson estate comes days after news broke of Catherine receiving a seven-figure allowance for the year. On March 21, Branca and McLean claimed in legal filings that Catherine received more than $55 million since the, the Will You Filing Billboard reports the documents were aimed at proving that the estate itself should not have to pay for Catherine's recent legal bills.
Branca and McLean argued that virtually no request of Mrs. Jackson for her care or maintenance has been declined in the years since Michael's 2009 death. Contrary to claims made by Mrs. Jackson's counsel, the executors have provided liberally for Mrs. Jackson's maintenance, care, and well-being, attorneys for Branca and McLean wrote. Since Michael's death, the executors have expended for Mrs. Jackson's benefit more than $55 million. The estate further claimed that Katherine Jackson allegedly received more than $33 million in cash, including an ongoing allowance of $1,600,000 per month, plus a $15 million luxury home, the estate claimed. Branca and McLean also claimed that they provided Catherine with an emergency $3.7 million payment in December to satisfy delinquent income tax liabilities. It is difficult to imagine that the trustees could provide any more liberally for Mrs. Jackson, attorneys for the executors wrote. Branca and McLean further claimed in their new filing that the estate should not have to pay Catherine's lawyers for filing objections that had caused substantial damage billboard shared. Importantly, this petition is not about Mrs. Jackson's maintenance, care, comfort, and support, the executor's attorneys wrote. This petition is about payment of attorney's fees for an objection filed on Mrs. Jackson's behalf, which the court overruled, and the subsequent frivolous and still pending appeal. In conclusion, the death of Michael Jackson continues to captivate the public's attention, with recent allegations suggesting a darker narrative surrounding his demise. The emergence of claims that Jackson believed his family members were plotting against him for his estate adds a new layer of intrigue to an already complex and contentious story. While the veracity of these allegations remains uncertain, they underscore the ongoing scrutiny and speculation surrounding Jackson's life and legacy. Regardless of the outcome of these investigations, one thing remains certain. Michael Jackson's impact on music and popular culture is indelible. His unparalleled talent, groundbreaking contributions to the entertainment industry, and enduring influence on generations of artists ensure that his legacy will endure for years to come. As fans continue to celebrate his music and remember his extraordinary achievements, the controversies surrounding his death serve as a sobering reminder of the complexities and challenges that often accompany fame and fortune. Ultimately, the truth behind Michael Jackson's death may never be fully revealed. However, what remains undeniable is the profound impact he had on the world and the enduring legacy he leaves behind as the king of pop.